why I have. Sí, pero la está bien, aguántalo ahí. Aguántalo ahí. Sí, sí. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you've been enjoying the videos from my Puerto Rico trip. My sister and I were looking for a last minute easy trip. This is my third time back to Puerto Rico. The tickets were super cheap. My sister had a voucher for JetBlue. It's the right time of year for winds and surfing in Puerto Rico. Several people asked me if I would be spearfishing in Puerto Rico and I told them no. I told them I just wanted to relax, take minimum gear, surf. I didn't know anybody in Puerto Rico who surfed. And that was the plan, just to have a surf trip. Well, two days before the trip was over, my sister is on Instagram and she realizes that someone she follows from Puerto Rico is shooting Wahoo. Wahoo is a fish that my sister and I have wanted to shoot for a long time. It's actually the right time of year to be spearfishing Wahoo in the Keys and we weren't able to go on the full moon because we booked this trip last minute. So she showed me the picture of the Wahoo and she's like, wow, wouldn't that be cool if we went spearfishing in Puerto Rico and got a Wahoo? I told her, well, comment me under that picture. So she did and I commented back Marilyn, oh my god, in Puerto Rico? We are in Puerto Rico. How do we make this happen? Is this a charter? A couple minutes later, I got a message and we were booked for the next day to go try to get some Wahoo. We drove to a dive store, rented some scuba gear. The guy who invited us, super nice, really good about letting us borrow gear from him. He had to work, so he told us he could only take us out for a couple hours, and we were really excited about that. The next morning, we met him at the boat ramp. The two of them took us out. We dropped in about 50 feet to grab some chum. I shot a nice jack. We started doing drifts. We did three drifts in total, and we saw Wahoo every time we ended up running out of chum and at one point and i went ahead and shot another blackjack for chum marilyn got a wahoo the first drift i ripped out of two different wahoo unfortunately nice jack we would drop deep and as we would drift it would get more and more shallow and the water is so amazingly clear in puerto rico that we could see bottom in no time on one of the drift, we realized that there was a lot of snapper in the area that were coming up for the chum. So we dropped a really big piece of chum and I swam down to about 60, 65 feet and shot a nice dog snapper. We had some motor issues in the morning. Our friend was able to change a fuse and we managed to get out, but when we went to come back in, we had some other motor issues, so he called a friend for a tow. While we were getting towed in, we got stopped by the police. Uh, because of coronavirus, people aren't really allowed to do charters right now. Okay. <laughs> 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 yeah! 
And when we got to the boat ramp, the trailer ended up having a flat tire. The thing I find most impressive about all of these things are our friends never complained once. They were really happy, really easy to get along with. They dealt with the problems as best they could and never got in a bad mood, never complained, never ruined our day. We had a great day. We stayed out for the full amount of time that we agreed upon. He actually got in really late because of the boat tow and wasn't able to make it into work, but he made sure that we got on the fish and we were extremely grateful for that. Is that how you have Is this, I mean, I've seen world record snappers on there. Yeah. Yeah, wow. Big ones. How deep is it? Uh, 65. Yeah. How deep is like it?
were going fast in a manatee zone. I don't know if you guys have manatee zones yeah. here. And uh, yeah, that, that is one of the strictest rules about navigation. Yeah, Julie's like, oh, I didn't know this was a manatee zone. I'm not from around here, born and raised, whatever. <laughs> so they're like, oh, well, uh, I guess we can let you off with a warning. And they're like, oh, you don't have a, a stern light. And she's like, yeah, I do. And she takes a pen out of her pocket that lights up. And and with a hair tie, ties it on the back of the bow. And he's like, all right, have a nice night, ladies. And they're like, what? And I was like, what the hell just <laughs> Tips! <laughs> <laughs> we are the money!